So welcome to another MJ, MJ Tech MJ, video MJ. and today we shall learn how to create an application that can run in the background when it is closed. So we are going to be using the notify icon control. Then first I will customize my form. So first, I'll change the start position to center screen so just that the application starts on the center of the screen. And then I'll change the form border style to none just so it's plain and I can customize it to how I want it. And then, we'll start the panel. And then we'll change the name to panel header just so we can easily identify them or identify it and then we dock it to the top and then change the color to let's say dark slate gray and then we reduce the height and then next we add a button which will be our close button our so-called close button <laughs> and then we we'll change the name for button close yes and also we we'll change the text to none which is we'll just clear it down then change it to flat the flat style to flat and then remove the border just so that the button doesn't have any outline on it and then insert the image of that close button so I'll just use a close button image which is this click OK and then that's how it is Size this up a little bit. And then we anchor this to the top right, not the top left. Just so that when it's launched, it's just anchored only. And then next, we'll add the main stuff, which is the notify icon control is at the bottom left of our screen and then we we'll insert an icon if you don't know how to create an icon I've got a video for you just click on the top right corner of the screen you see a video there which you can use to create any icon of your choice you create an, you create an image and then you can convert it to an icon that's the tutorial and then all that's left is to write the code so we double click on the close button to write the code for the close button which is me.hide which means anytime the close button is clicked uh, the form just we just hide not to close and then next we write the code for the notification to pop up which is the name of the control which is notify icon Notify icon one dot show balloon tip and then the content of what that notify icon or the notification pop up is going to show. And then this will be the title of that notification, which is MG Enterprise. just simple all all that is needed is that when the close button is clicked the form just hides and then it it it, it leaves the taskbar is not there and then a notification is going to pop up saying which, which the title is going to be MG Enterprise and then the content of that 
notification will be. The application was closed but is still running in the notifications panel. And then we would add an information icon in the balloon tip, which is the eye icon. So that's it. Then let's write the code for the notify icon when it is clicked. Or let's say let's write the code when the icon is clicked, which is we dot show, which is which means the application is going to be relaunched. And uh, almost like the same code we wrote before. Which is notify icon dot show balloon tip. The four hundred and fifty represents the timing, which is four point five seconds. It means the balloon tip is going to launch for four point five seconds. And then the header is going to be MJ Enterprises. Well, you can name yours anyone you want. Well. Where I put MG Enterprise, you can put the name of your application, which is, let's say it's an antivirus, for example. When it is closed, it should say maybe Smadam Antivirus as the header, and then whatever information follows. And then let's launch this application to see. Oh, let's minimize this. And then when it is closed, you see MG Enterprise is the header. Then the content. So when the icon is clicked, which is the notify icon, you see the application relaunches and then shows a balloon tip, which is application has been opened. Then that's it. Thank you so so much for watching my video. Please like and subscribe if you find this video helpful. And then bye bye.